There's no blues rock artist hotter right now than Larkin Poe. Sisters Rebecca and Megan Lovell have been on a wildly successful run since last year when we featured them in one of our Artist Spotlight episodes. Hi there, I'm Guillermo from Fortivo Music, and it's time for an artist update. You may already be a huge Larkin Poe fan, in which case, please use the comments below to share any news you may have on them. And if you're just hearing about them for the first time, then you might want to start with the Artist Spotlight video we produced and then visit their channel directly. Before we get going, we want to thank ProTech for sponsoring this episode. Please stay tuned to the end to learn more about these amazing watches. And if you want to support our channel while also getting a discount on a great watch, then please use our special link and code in the description below to order online. Now, let's catch up with Larkin Poe. As a reminder, when we published last year's Artist Spotlight episode featuring Larkin Poe, they had just gone on tour to support their 2022 album, Blood Harmony. In fact, quick personal side note, I managed to catch their kickoff show in North Carolina and meet the girls before they went on stage. That US tour ran from January to April 2023, and that was backed up by a European tour in the fall of 2023. Throughout 2024, the sisters continued performing at various music festivals, bringing their high-energy blues rock sound to a growing base of adoring fans. Their hard work on Blood Harmony also brought them recognition from the music industry. At the 2024 Americana Honors and Awards, they won the Duo or Group of the Year Award. And at the 66th Grammy Awards, their Blood Harmony album won for Best Contemporary Blues Album. Riding this tidal wave of positive momentum, the sisters continue to create new music. Their next album, which will be their eighth studio album, will be released on January 24th. It's called Bloom, and it was produced by Rebecca's husband, Tyler Bryant. As of when we're recording this episode, they've already released three tracks from the new album onto their YouTube channel. They're exactly the powerful blues rock you'd expect from Larkin Poe. You should definitely check out Blueforia, If God is a Woman, and Mockingbird with more tracks on the way. Also, they've already announced a tour to support this album in 2025. They'll start the US leg of the tour in April and then hop over to Europe in October to finish out the year. If you've never experienced them live, then please make sure you get out to one of their shows next year. Well, that's a quick recap on Larkin Poe's busy last year or so. If there's anything we missed, please let us know in the comments below. Now, let's all get ready for some new songs off Bloom, and hopefully we'll see you at one of their shows in 2025. Until next time, happy listening. As we mentioned earlier, our channel now has a strategic relationship with ProTech, an official watch of the U.S. Marine Corps. ProTech is a new American brand of tritium tactical and sports watches that are rugged at heart and built to handle what life demands in any environment. They're designed in Switzerland for law enforcement, SWAT, tactical, military, special forces, firefighters, and first responders. Lightweight and comfortable, the brand features a superlative self-powered illumination system that glows continuously for 25 years without a need to charge the dial with an external light source. For a 20% discount off one of these incredible watches, please follow the link in the description and use our code MUSICROCKS. Thanks again for your ongoing support.